you. And that's what I love about Barbara's designs. Like, it actually reminds me of what we were just talking about with Robert Lee Morris, where he said, like, the, you know, jewelry is supposed to be noticeable. It's supposed to say something about you. And certainly you'll see that here. Oh, my word. Look at this. <laughs> The abalone and limon quartz snake ring. This is on six easy monthly payments, $109.83. Usually I reach in for a piece and I start moving it back and forth. This doesn't need that. <laughs> like it already has the wow factor without me kind of going, ooh, look at the sparkle, right? This was actually designed for couture and the buyers well, who saw it course. said, please, please, please. You get it. <laughs> and I'll say, thank you, thank you, thank you. How's that? Oh my gosh, it's like, where do we even begin? I, I love I love playing with gemstones, and you've probably seen like my carved gemstone faces and yes. and things. And here I wanted to sort of mimic snakeskin with gemstones. Oh, I see. So the abalone under the limon gives a, you know, we've done it under um, clear okay, quartz before. The, there's the abalone. But with the limon, it really brings out the colors more, right. and it does sort of have that feeling of snakes. It too. does. I see it now that you say it. And, and the reason that that is kind of the goal here is because of the snake itself. Of the snakes. So we have two snakes, one on each side, and those are all paved in pink garnet, which is oh. one of my favorite stones with a black sapphire on each head. And then you've got your gold so leaves edgy. and the signature gold flowers on the top. I really love this ring. I do too. And then of course we get, you know, every every ring of yours is just like layer cake. Like we keep revealing more and more that we love. I mean, look at where the whole story begins. I couldn't help but show everybody the abalone underneath, right? Because this is that doublet. And the, you know, the light, the way a gallery is constructed is also to let the light come through that stone. That's why you often see piercing in, in the galleries. No. So there's definitely and a height to this, right? Bold, right. but super comfortable. Mm -hmm. I always say, you know, that women designers have that edge. We get our sample right. and you, you put, it, put it, on, it on. Yeah. And it's got to feel good. I mean, look at that. Guys, look, there's a science to this, to be able to craft a piece with this much going on and still have it just perfectly balanced. And then the symbolism of the ring, um, snakes are guardians, they, they're said to be guardians of the temple, they're a protection, um, but they also speak to change, mm -hmm. wisdom and knowledge, and abalone is also a stone that speaks to the beauty of change in our life. So it's sort of this, uh, and the pink garnet is a stone of love, so it's having this love and protection around us as we go through our changes in life. And I'd love that you chose this particular stone, like you could have gone with the crystal quartz, but adding that element, almost like a like saturating it in sunlight, right? And creating it that. It brings a different dimension yeah. to it than the clear quartz. It's unexpected. Mm. So let me give you measurements here. Well, first I'll give you the details, right? So gemstone weight, just under one carat, 95 points. We're talking about uh, the lemon quartz there. One inch long, seven eighths of an inch wide. The metal work here, as with literally every other piece that we're presenting, is cast sterling silver and cast 18 karat gold. I want to make sure we make that clear that this is not a brushing no plating. or a plate. No. <laughs> Barbara always says that with eyes wide. No plating, right? She wants to make sure that you understand. And I know sometimes it's hard to believe. We talk about 18 karat, but we talk about price points that are you know, certainly more affordable than doing typically 18 karat right. gold. But this is kind of like the compromise that Barbara makes to make sure she adheres to her artistic aesthetic, like her goal. And that's to bring you the very finest pieces, ones that you would say are literally your own couture collection. And in this case, is direct from her couture line straight to you. It's one of those pieces where you probably want to ask us how you get one of these things so that you can have it on your bedside table and you can always look at it even when you're not wearing it. But we acknowledge it's still an investment, right? At 659, we put it on the highest easy payment available so that you can spread that out over six months time at $109.83. 83 cents. Five, six, and seven, nine, and ten. So it looks like we're missing size eight on this one. This happens frequently because I would imagine in a piece like this, it's not like you have enough stones to create 10,000. No. Things, right? <laughs> All right, it's J32, 7505. And while it's a bold piece, guess what, guys? There's even more to come. It's like this is just a fun one to watch, and then maybe you'll find something you can't live without. So, if you're really loving the QVC2 Big Deal, um, I invite you to also consider this bangle. Today is actually the last day to enjoy the feature price on this sterling and 18 karat gold flower gemstone bangle. So on five easy monthly payments of $52.80, J331627. Here's what we have. 
uh, citrine at last call, actually, blue topaz, and then that pink garnet that we love so, so much. I think those are just pretty and fun and yeah, timeless. Light and bouncy and I, like I think I'm jingle. in that mood because it was so warm out today. Right? I'm like, I'm, oh, I'm so excited and I just want to freshen everything up. All right, guys, we need to talk about this. And I don't even know who put together exactly what was going to be in the show, but whoever that person is, they know me well. <laughs> because here it is, my pick of the show. It is the Buddha Enhancer 